Oh, you are so brave. Let's go, dude! Wait, why am I doing this again? It's Maxim Brain's new rule. Before getting any food, I have to defeat one villain or clean my room. I haven't eaten in months! I don't usually question you, Eric, but this time your plan feels a little too plummety and splatty. We're skydiving onto a blimp. What could possibly go wrong? Um, we're skydiving onto what now? <laughs> Don't tell me. They went splat, right? <laughs> it's over, Cumulate. Needles, how did you find me? You're the only villain stealing manatees and flying in a giant junk-sucking blimp. Fair enough. What can I say? I am a hoarder. I love stuff. <laughs> you sound funny. <laughs> Wait, I do too. It's like that time I inhaled all those helium balloons at that toddler's birthday party. <laughs> he cried for hours. That was me. It's hydrogen, actually. Same silly voice, but much more explosive if someone was crazy enough to say, uh, oh, fire a laser cannon. Like this one? Exactly like that one. You're trying to trick me. Well, I'm hungry and I am not cleaning my room. So take this, brain. <laughs> and you too, Cumulate. Ha! Who's crazy now? I'm alive? Yes! I knew my silly unnecessary risk wouldn't end badly. Right, Trevor? <gasps> Trevor, is that you? You're in that body cast for some other reason, and not because I made you jump into a giant blimp vacuum and then blew up said giant blimp vacuum. Right? Uh, uh, maybe I did have a little something to do with it. <laughs> Eric, we got here as soon as we could after stopping at the salon for five hours. Kitty, you know what flying at ultrasonic speed does to my hair. Uh, ah! Don't worry, Trevor. I know I messed up, but I'm gonna stand by your plastery side until you're back on your feet. <laughs> Ew. Ew. Now, let's get you out of this crummy, state-of-the-art, highly respected hospital. There we go. Home, sweet. Oops. <laughs> uh, I meant to get that fixed. And that. That I had nothing to do with. There you go, buddy. I'll just prop you up here on the couch. There. Just type what you need to say and the computer will translate it into your own voice. You really think I can type with my toe? Whoa, dosses are amazing. Sweet! The Maxim Toe Typer's working great! Phew! Okay, man. What else can I get you? Movie? Video game? Just name it. I hate to be a bother, Eric, but could you run a few errands for me? <laughs> dude! Why are you talking weird? You never call me Eric. It's always dude or man or buddy. And you love being a bother. And who says errands? <laughs> Don't you mean stink jobs? Um, that is what I meant. Do my stink jobs. That's more like it. Wow, um, some of this stuff is really expensive and hard to find. Ow, my bone. How I wish I never got blown up by my best friend. You're right. I'll get all this weird stuff for you, pal. I promise. Here's those 12 vacuum motors, man. Oh, and the girls are here. <laughs> Eric, don't you think it's a little odd that Trevor asked you to get a bunch of blimp and vacuum parts? Right after we battled a villain who flew a giant blimp vacuum? What? No! Trevor just needed this stuff for his... Wait, what is this stuff for again? Um, oh, uh, oh, ow, ow, my body. Oh, no! Dude, I feel terrible for doubting. Uh, is there anything else you need?
Well, a roll of two ply super strength titanium foil to reinforce my blimp. I mean, to cover my leftovers. <gasps> oh, your concern for your surplus food is so touching. You got it. How could anyone be so clueless? No kidding. Hey, do you mind? <laughs> <laughs> Now, if I was a package of super strength titanium foil, where would I be? Hey, dude. Hey, do you know where the super foil is? Sure do, buddy. Aisle five. Thanks. <laughs> Free cheese! <laughs> wow! Holy guacamole, dude! What are you doing here? I'm eating tiny spear cheese samples! What are you doing here? But, 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 but. You're at the mansion right now in a body cast! <laughs> I wish! Casts are awesome! They're itchy, they stink, and hair grows like crazy underneath them. This is from the last cast I wore. <laughs> but how did you not get hurt in the crash? Wait, how did I not get hurt in the crash? If you haven't been at the mansion, then who has? Dun dun dun! Accumulate! <laughs> That's right, Needles. Thanks so much for helping me rebuild my evil master plan. Oh, and that automatic body cast escape saw came in super handy. Aw, oh, man! I thought I was taking care of you this whole time. Really? You would have taken care of me? You're a good friend, man. When this is over, we should do something nice. Just the two of us. Like a movie or... I don't know how nice a movie is. It doesn't have to be a movie. I just thought you wanted to see... Yeah, no, it's fine. It's okay. Yeah, it's fine. Um, guys, think you could start saving the day here a little bit? There will be no day saving once Eric hands over that foil. I can finish patching my blimp and my hoarding will resume. You still got the foil even after you found the real Trevor? Why? And so I could say this. <clears throat> Accumulate! It looks like your plan is officially foiled. Huh? Nice! Solid one-liner, Mr. Needles. But I think you still fail to appreciate exactly how much my plan sucks! <laughs> my pun's still better. Oh, so I see you've gotten yourself into yet another fine mess. You know, Brain, you could help us escape instead of giving yet another boring lecture. Yes, I could, but why would I? Because if you do this one thing for me, I will perform the most heroic, most day-saving, most death-defying feat ever! I will clean my room! Huh? Agreed! No take-backs. This is pretty much exactly what I expected your room would look like. Inner sanctum. What? What? are we doing here, Eric? I mean, shouldn't we be chasing Cumulate? Why chase the fish when you've got bait? Wait, fish? What? Fish. The villain? He's the fish, and the messy room is the bait? Uh, you have lost me, Eric. I'm stumped too, dude. Whoosh! What he said? It's a metaphor! Or maybe a simile. I always mix those two. Oh, never mind. Just watch. You're too late, Needles! I've already escaped! Free to hoard again! <laughs> A drat. Well, I'm just glad that you didn't hoard my room before escaping. And to think, all this time you've been sitting right next to the greatest pile of cool junk the world has ever known! <sighs> really? Where? Oh, so much junk! Tell me about it. Oh well, I guess you're just... <laughs> so much junk! So much stuff! Suck! Suck! Ah! Think he learned his lesson and filled the balloon with helium this time instead of hydrogen? <laughs> Ha, 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 ha!
Guess not. Well, it looks like having a disgustingly messy room saved the day after all. You never said anything like that. Yep, saved the day. Hey, our voices are going all squirrely again. <laughs> oh my, was anyone turning off the hydrogen valve after Cumulate's blimp took off? <laughs> Seriously, though? Your plan is foiled? What's not to like? Now that I like. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> no, wait! <laughs> <laughs> Don't make me go to you! Parent-teacher night! <laughs> oh, I am your legal guardian, so it is my duty to go. Plus, I would never miss hearing what a bad student you are. Okay, you're enjoying this way too much. Oh, oh. Ah. How am I doing, Trevor? A little more. A little more. Go forward. More, go up, rotate right way. You're good. Namaste, fellow child inspirers. Peace and love. Child inspirers? That's not even a word. Promise you're not going to embarrass me. Fear not, son child. Embarrassment comes from within. Yeah, sometimes it comes on a bike. Fly free, my friends. Uh, why can't you just be normal? Like Kitty's parents. Come huh? along, Pumpkin. <laughs> Let's protect. Ha! Oh, wow! <laughs> How lucky is it that my parents, who are perfectly normal, weren't crushed to death? <laughs> so lucky. That's how lucky. <laughs> Uh, excuse me, I've got to go repair someone. Oh, I mean something. Parents, Parents and, students. and students! Parents, Parents and, students, and students, thank you for coming. And welcome to the parent-teacher night of doom. <laughs> Why is everything at Splitsboro always something, something of doom? Oh. <laughs> Eric is hands down my worst student ever. Seriously, ever! Ah, there's the doom. For his science project, he handed in what I believe to be an automatic waffle maker. <laughs> what? Everybody loves waffles. Uh, so, <clears throat> dare I ask? Trevor cheats, lies, destroys things, burns them, then blows them up. Uh, he's got me pegged. And now, the bad stuff. I see your point. Aunt Vanna has always been the top-notch student. A real delight, for example. Ooh, you look tense. What are you doing? He was about to tell you how amazing I am. Are, are you touching me? I think she's touching me. Relax. Be at one with your body, your mind, the universe. This is an outrage! No! But I already told you, there is no need to go through Kitty's old tests. They're all A's! Incorrect. Kitty received one B. Ah, yeah. Well, nobody's perfect, right? Unacceptable grade alert! We must have grade perfection! Initiating massive destruction! What <laughs> 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 on top of that, it's powered by an incredibly dangerous collapsed star which could destroy the planet! <laughs> Come on! I couldn't find any batteries! <laughs> oh, 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 my ram hurts from laughing so hard! And Trevor is lazy, self-centered, loves destruction, and is quite possibly totally evil. In short, he will make an excellent sidekick. What? That's a lie. La, 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 la. I'm not excellent. I'm not excellent at anything. You must be so proud. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 
<laughs> All right, everyone. I hope the parent and or guardian teacher interview process was less painful for you than it was for me. Oh, speaking of pain, let the pain begin. Pain? What? We have to show our families what we've learned at sidekick school. We've got to attack them and win. This is gonna be so good. Remember, if you defeat your family members, your grades go up. If you lose, you must attend night school, overnight school, pre-breakfast school, and back in time school. Parents, students, attack at will! I love this part. I would be enjoying this. <laughs> Look, I know you're all about peace and love and other useless stuff, so I promise to take it easy on you. That is so sweet of you, dear. Oh. Um... Come back! I have to defeat you! But I don't want to fight you! Grades aren't that important to me! If you fail to comply, we will destroy you! <gasps> Never! <laughs> Take your best shot, Trevor. You need all the grades you can get. You've had this coming for a long time, Dad. Where is she? I'm right here, sweetie. Ah! Yeah! Ah! Ah! Watch your breathing, dear. In and out. Would you stand still? Big ah! back and back. <laughs> hey, you don't have to try so hard. No, no, no. It is being my absolute pleasure. It is not hard at all. <laughs> Fine. Then I'll give you something hard. Waffle iron hard. Hey. Oh. Oh. Well, this is annoying. <laughs> Pumpkin is attempting to leave school early. Initiate top lock mode. We know what's best for you. And what's best for you is to get good grades or be destroyed. My good, you're a Come on, son, you have to defeat me or you're gonna fail. My reply to you is. Oh. I believe my son has defeated me with his devilishly masterful paper cut plan. The <laughs> oh. genius Trevor, a pass for you. And once again. I can't do this anymore. I'm so tired. You wouldn't have this problem if you just learned to breathe, sweetness. In with the good, and out with the bad. In. Out. <gasps> That's it. In. Out. In. Out. I win! Wow, that breathing stuff really works! <laughs> Last chance, pumpkin! Fight us! Voice authorization, Kitty loves Eric! <laughs> okay, fine! Now you know! My parents are robots! There, I said it! 
Doctor. Yeah. It explains so much. So you don't think it's weird? Oh, that is such a relief. I thought everyone would think I was wacko because I built my own parents. Ew, you built your parents? Mm. Wow. What? Oh. Ah! Put me down! When I am about to defeat you and condemn you to an eternity of schooling? Ah, that is a good one. Then you've left me no choice. <laughs> Haven't we been through this before, Waffle Boy? This, yes. But not this! <gasps> Uh-oh, the collapsed star. Even Eric wouldn't be foolish enough to... <laughs> yes, he would. In case nobody heard it earlier, I did say oops. Well, technically, you did defeat Max and Brain, so you pass. Yay! And for making terrible waffles, you no longer pass. Aw, oh, man. <laughs>